G'day mate, how you going? Welcome to the Green and Gold Life. Ah, rightio, so it's uh, Sunday morning. Uh, it's the day of the barbecue, yes! So uh, people are gonna be showing up uh, probably in about two hours time, around about that 11 o'clock mark. We'll spark up the barbie and get it going. So it's my little girl's first birthday. Who could believe it, man? It, you know, it's hard to believe. Um, she's always been sort of like that 25th percentile, so she's pretty small. But uh, yeah, and she's lacking a bit of hair, just like grandpa. <laughs> so um, yeah, nah, look, can't believe it. And uh, I wish her the best for her birthday. Rightio, so I thought I'd give you a little bit of a match report on how the Kaiku is looking. So I was out here um, first thing this morning. I wouldn't characterize it as Sparrow's fart, but you know, there was limited light conditions and I was out here knocking the dew off this morning because I knew I was going to be putting in an early mode today. So, And the Kaiku is not looking too bad, man. You know, it's looking all right. Um, I reckon though we may have peaked around about Thursday midweek, so uh, that's all right, man. We can work with that. I'm, I'm sure we'll still have fun anyway. So um, let's jump down there and have a look, eh? Oh boy, have a look at what we've got here, man. Unreal. So uh, look, it does want like a little bit of a scalp, especially up the top here, because this just goes gangbusters. But it's the wrong time to be doing it, man, just before a barbecue. So what happened was I was um, blower vacuuming under the pergola and I thought, oh, I'll just duck down the shed and go and get the hoover. And I'd suck up all this snot and it just sort of dug in a bit, so. <laughs> anyway, that's all right, we can, we can live with that. But I do reckon we'll see uh, a full recovery here before winter time, so I'm not stressing there. Right here, let's move down the hill, eh? Who we got here, man? Who's this little rat bag here? So um, we've got a little bit of clover popping up here. I reckon this would have started probably about three or four weeks ago when I had um, uh, when I had that little nitrogen deficiency. So um, yeah, I'd, I'm not going to pull it out today though because what I want to do is is really just give it a mow. Um, next week, what I'm looking at doing is giving it possibly a little bit of a shave and then a hand weed. So I don't want to go doing it today because if I do it today, I could pull up a whole bunch of um, a whole bunch of kaiku with it and like have soil uh, on the surface and I don't want to run that through my through my Scott Bonner. So uh, I'm going to leave that here for today, which is going to kill me, but we're going to leave it here today and we're going to sort it out next week, I reckon. Rightio, let's make a start, eh? take this time just to stop mid mo have a look see if we're square yeah. it's not looking too bad up, up on the ramps looks good let's have a look out here yes i don't think we're too bad the feeling is we're straight which is the wind but a bit tough to tell a bit tough to tell there i think they're all right <laughs>
so not a bad mow in the end. I think everything is actually square, which is good. So um, let's have a look at our clipping yield. So yeah, no, it's not bad, eh? Um, it looks nice and healthy, and the cuts actually look relatively square, which is good as well. So pretty cheering about that. Although having a look at the length of some of the clippings there, I do think we have broken the one third rule in some areas. Um, but that's all right. Like, when did I mow it? Thursday and it's Sunday. Yeah, it's a little bit. Yeah. Uh, maybe, yeah, maybe. Radio, I better roll on with the front lawn, eh? We didn't quite make it. The folks started rolling in while I was emptying the catcher to the Scotty, so that was it. Had to pull up stumps for the afternoon and, uh, you know, go and talk to them. So essentially they were here to see the family and the daughter and not me mowing my lawn. So <laughs> I don't know why, man. You know, have a look at this. Hey, excellent stuff. But uh, yeah, it almost looks like it wants another chop. <laughs> I haven't got scratch for a charity mow at the moment, mate. Bloody fuels at $2.30 a litre. Crikey. So uh, yeah, we'll probably wrap it up there, I think. Um, really happy with how the lawn's come into its own in the last couple of weeks. It's really bouncing back strong. And I think we're gonna be in a good position for winter, which is rad. So I think moving forward now, we might start to think about lifting our height of cut a little bit, but uh, we might suss that out next week. All right, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like and consider subscribing to the channel. You guys do me a wicked mad favor and take it easy. I'll chat you on.